actually at the moment the metal e plastic is instantly getting cool that's a really nice sensation it's like Welcome to LJP Tech Channel. Please subscribe, like, and comment. Make sure you press the bell button as well. Now, I present to your host, LJP Tech. So it's the time of the year when sun is shining and heat is really getting onto your nerves and you're not in a particular environment where you can actually afford an air conditioning or whether you could turn on the air conditioning because of the price of the energy has gone up and so on or you, and you just want to cool yourself down or let's say if you're in the middle of the train and you know that the body temperature has actually mounted up in the train what well, plus the sunlight is just making the whole place like a sauna on your way to work or returning from work that's when you can actually apply the cooler a wearable air conditioning and iron purifying device but not only the air conditioning uh, sort of system it also has the heating system as well so you could apply this in the middle of winter as well so this is a very interesting product indeed so this i believe has two sensors that you could actually attach to your neck and i think there's one in the back as well i'm not sure whether the back is actually support we're going to find out anyway but this is in the middle of the crowdfunding campaign so i'm really honored to receive this item so i want to thank team cooler to send me this device so enough said let's get into the unboxing here it goes let's take this out ah so you could erase it from the cover now before we get to the actual device it comes with this nice boxing here so this will basically be the usb-c charger would it yep it's a reasonably good quality usb-c cable so please do take this with you all the time to charge your device so the moment of truth this is the actual main device you can see there's a power in the middle so h for heating on the left hand side and c for cooling on the right hand side and um, this is very well ergonomically designed because of the thickness it will settle well on the back of your neck with the rubbery support on the back and also this will sit well on your shoulder so that's very promising indeed so there's a grill on the back and the middle with the screen on and in the front as well there's a grill okay so that's applied to the both end and we got this metally plastic on both front which i presume will get cold cooler or hotter depending on what sort of system you want to be on so um, before we get into this also that's where you actually plug in your usb-c to charge it and so on so let's turn it on to start with and then let's try the cooling shall we right so it says 25 degrees and you got this really cool sort of green light i love that and it's very quiet i don't know whether you can hear it so i'll, I'll be silent for a moment so that'll be very minimal sort of disruptive actually let's take off my mic and actually put it onto the device that's how quiet it is so hardly anyone will notice you other than this cool led and the screen on your neck okay so let's say if i actually turn on the c again it will say c2 c3 c4 so there's four different modes so i presume c4 is the strongest sort of um oh i can see that c4 is for aiming for 15 degrees of your body temperature c1 is for 25 c2 is for 21 i think that's more ideal isn't it C3 is for 18 and C4 is for 15. Okay, that's how it works. So let's try the H for heating, shall we? So H1 is for temperature of 38. C H2 is for um, 40. Wow, I can already feel the heat coming from this pad. H3 is for 42. Who wants to reach to 42? That's really mad. And h4 is for 45 and it's it's getting really warm here and so on that so that's very interesting so enough said let's actually try it on shall we 
So once you press the power button in the middle, it shows the battery level being 95% on the right hand side screen. It doesn't show on the left hand side, but it doesn't matter. But let's actually press the C for cooling mode of C1, C2. Let's actually try C3, shall we? So actually at the moment, the metal E plastic is instantly getting cool. That's a really nice sensation. It's like, um, as you can see or hear, uh, the white noise in the background is very minimal. So again, I don't think this is going to be intrusive, disruptive in a public space. Probably some people who are very sensitive will be able to detect this, but uh, nonetheless, this plasticky thing is instantly um, cooling up this pad, both of them. And that's actually cooling the front part of both ends of my neck and that's a very weird sensation it's um okay so there's no fan blowing as such and technically it's also cleansing the air on the background as well but i'm more focusing on the actual experience here the first hand experience and i don't understand how it works but it feels like i don't know whether you guys try tiger bomb kind of feel it's actually when you actually apply it to a certain area is it, this medicine this cream uh, basically cools the area that's the similar sensation you get from this whole thing and um, somehow i think this is now sending a message through the neck to my brain saying hey cool yourself down that's very weird sensation i never experienced such thing wow okay I can hear the fans getting a bit louder now, but overall, I'm actually in a very heated environment at the moment. As you know, the, the, the sunlight is coming through. And um, for some reason, because this is a perfect environment to experience on, I'm not sweating anymore. That's very weird. How does it work? And I could feel my neck, both of my neck and is really sort of cooled down. So basically this nerve point, is it actually triggering the whole body to cool down instantly? To say, hey, don't worry about the heat. It's like a trick, isn't it? That's very interesting. So other than the actual blow of the air, because it's actually blowing quicker to the surrounding air, this is basically a cold touch on both of your front of your neck, saying, hey, calm down. It's gonna be fine. And therefore, I'm in a perfect environment that I could easily sweat myself, but I'm no longer sweating anymore. That's very weird. <laughs> Amazing. So I have to say I thoroughly enjoy reviewing this Kula wearable air conditioning device, but not only for air conditioning, you could also use this during the winter for heating up your body as well. And it's amazing how these uh, front um, two rather metally plastic pads of this cold sensation or the heat sensation can tell your body to cool down or heat up and so on so i'm i'm really interested to find out how the methodology works but it does work in my body and it's because as a proof to show you is that i'm actually in the middle of the studio where in in the middle of summer it could really quickly gather up heat um, it's almost 1 p.m. in the afternoon here and I will normally be sweating a lot um, for this sort of weather but as you can see I'm hardly sweating here you can see that there's no sweat patch any of my body and that's why I wore this um, gray t-shirt here as well so I have to say the white noise level is very um, confidential and also I just love the fact that there's this LED uh, thing that could actually show off to the person sitting next to you um, this is not a particular fan. It's not called a fan that blows a warm air, surrounding warm air to you. It's basically those two cold pads on the front that touches your front of your neck to tell your body to cool down or heat up. So that's amazing indeed. So I just want to thank uh, the team cooler uh, to send this sample to me. And I have to say definitely it works as a proof for where I am and how I want to use it and so on especially for a guy like me who are very prone to sweating and so on. So I hope this video was very useful to understand what this product is, but if you have any queries, please do comment below. And thank you very much for watching this video. This is LJP Tech. All the best. Bye-bye.